where to start. My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. The people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddies showed up and saved the both of us. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Resident Evil Village. Favreau's here. So that was just a little recap of what was happening in Resident Evil 7 because I'm not playing that currently on my channel and I haven't ever played it, but I have watched people play through the game. So I was just like, okay, let me do a re little recap because these are connected. Um, but that game's been out for so long, so hopefully that wasn't spoilers. Hopefully you've played the game or you watched someone else play the game. But I'm so excited. Let's dive in. Alright, I already did the options and stuff, so we should just be good to go. We're going to play just on standard. And let's see, I have watched someone play through the, I think, I don't remember who I watched through this oh i think i watched gab smolders play through this but that was when it first came out so it's been a while i have not watched anyone else play it since village of shadows long ago a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father who was hard at work but the forest greeted them with a dark cold silence the bushes empty Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared and with a click of his fingers crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror 
filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Alright, that kind of reminded me a little bit of like Little Those Nightmares. Gave, but more you took, she snarled. Aww. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. The woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. Aww. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. I love baby so much. Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk around the house a little bit. Uh, just see what's going on. But I was going to say, I was like, I like when they wear their cute little sweaters. Assuming it's going to be upstairs. I don't think I can really look at anything holding the bit. Oh. Once things warm up, we can go for a walk. Yeah, okay. I guess it's winter time. No, we can look around. Holding a baby. Somehow, I'm just opening it telepathically. Because both my hands are on the baby. Hey, don't mind me. Oh, is that marinara? You hungry? No? Maybe later then. Oh, I like how the baby's sleeping. He's still asking her, are you Don't hungry? Don't get too close to me when I'm cooking, babe. Okay, why? <sighs> Our taste in music's definitely improved over the years. You mean mine has. <laughs> All right. Oh, wait, how do I... Okay, nothing. Oh, Mia. What a miracle. I say, I don't really remember everything that happened in seven. Mom got you another new book. Books are good. It is funny because I am gonna probably play the games obviously out of order. Because I do still want to play seven. It was just this one was like really on sale. Took forever to pick these wipes. Why didn't he say that out loud? I do not know. Alright, I think we're ready to just go upstairs. Oh, no, don't cry. I'm sorry it took so long. There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. I mean, it is more scary, I feel like, than the other fairy tales. But most fairy tales are actually... have creepy annotations behind it. But I guess now, why am I in the bathroom? <laughs> Mia's medication. She's been on a strict regimen ever since probably that day. Why? Why is he not talking sometimes? It's really weird. Your mama and I love this song so much. I thought this was a puzzle. No. Almost there, honey. Wait. Where was the master bedroom? Oh, maybe we just share a room right now? Yeah, okay, this checks out. Because I was like, she is still a baby. Like, a little baby. I wonder if I'll still be able there to look go, around. Sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. <laughs> oh, I thought Mia was gonna be like right behind me. Well, I can move so fast now. I don't got a baby weighing me down. Nothing. Oh. Oh. Close it. Oh, February 6, 2021. Mia and I had another fight. 
I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly. But I still feel like a part of me is trapped in that hellhole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over our heads? We owe her that much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Rosemary Winters. Oh, this is the baby. February 8th, 2020. 24 inches, 14 pounds. That's a big baby! Oh, this is a checkup. I was about to say. <laughs> Screenings. All results show no issues. Patient is in good health. Results for additional fungal pathogen tests will be provided by BSA. Oh, that's the, um, like, stars, right? Applefield Memorial Hospital. Rose is fine. This would be terrifying. Like, just even going through that. Rose's favorite toy. Oh, it has the baby monkey. Gun survivalist. A heavy firearms manual for... Paranoia if they're really out to get you. For field combat situations by Joseph Kendo. That name sounded familiar. Oh, they made their own scrapbook. It won't let me turn the page. Oh, there we go. Aww, the ultrasounds, and then baby Rose, so cute. Oh, they're here with their monkey outfit, one. with their baby monkeys. Oh, that's it. All right, is dinner done? Do you need help cooking dinner? That's when I'm going like guy voice, kind of guy voice. To do oh, there was stuff over here. Did I go over here already? It's kind of dark. I need a flashlight. Oh. <coughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Yeah, why is stuff just thrown around in here? Like the chairs, why are they topsy turvy? I can understand having clutter, but not like that. Curtain closes on the Delvey gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into the Delvey toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. Jack Baker, 57, and his family, who were exposed to the gas, perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. I mean, they covered it up, obviously, because they could just have it out. I don't know why. Like, why hide things like this? A historical look at the architecture of Eastern European castles and keeps by George Trevor. That name also sounds familiar to me, but I don't know. Maybe it's just because I have watched them play this before, but I don't... Those sound like names that were, like, in the first game or something. I don't know why. I, now we have explored everywhere. This is a nice house. Two bedroom. I like the layout of, like... I want a house with like a separate dining area, like a closed in dining area, separate from the kitchen. I think that'd be good. Oh, was there a door over there? Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Mm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de lagum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Local wine too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. It looks you really delicious. Have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be. Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so. <laughs> Mia, get down. What is happening? Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Mia, oh god. Chris? 
What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. Is he dreaming? No! What? Why? Alright, no explanation. Just diving right in here. What? Oh, move! Oh, my bad. I didn't. Oh, I'm not actually controlling. Okay. What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Back it secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Is it a dream? Oh, I think so, right? Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I've got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about them. How about next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just... Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Okay, so that was a flashback. Oh, she's probably worried about herself. Oh, my little angel. Because, like, wasn't she... She was transformed, too, but not fully. So she's probably like, you're just worried about our child and not me. But I think he is worried about both of them. It's just like Rose can't tell them because she's a baby. She can't say like, oh, I'm not feeling well. Where am I? Am I in a bed? Oh, no, I'm on the ground. Jesus. Oh, what the heck? Those are hands. Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off my walk Fuck. What the hell happened to you? Whoa. Yeah, wait. This a van? Oh. Mission objectives, eliminate target, recover body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two win Winterses to Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. So I think I need to turn down my mic a little bit. Okay, that might be a little bit better. I am gonna be exploring a lot, so it might get a little boring. How do I crouch? Okay, there, oh, I can't, wait, can I go inside? No. I have not played a horror game in a bit, so, and it's also almost spooky season. Technically, I've already decorated my house for spooky season, but I know October is when most people start decorating, so. Uh, I don't know how I have a flashlight, but I do. I think I just woke up with it in my hand, right, or something? Ooh, spooky vibes. It's so dark. Like, what is happening? I feel like he was dreaming, so maybe he dreamed of that, but something else happened. Because I honestly do not remember. 
I heard that behind me. Oh. Yeah, watch out for- oh! I just said watch out! Yeah, it's like, stand back up. You don't have to crouch the whole time. Ew. Dead bird. Crow. I think that was a raven, actually. The beak looked bigger to me. Oh, more. Hi there. Whoa, a lot more. Holy cow. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I don't think I could have saved that. I don't think I have a weapon or anything right now. Was that something? Oh, I saw you! I saw you! It is so dark. I know that's the point, it's the middle of the night. But like, I can barely see in front of my face. Okay, we got garbage. Oh, here we are. Let me just climb in through here, probably. Oh, no, I'm not gonna just barge. Oh, lovely. Hello, anyone home? I thought that was a brush made out of teeth. I'm gonna be completely honest. Weapon? Oh. He was opening it, like, so theatrically, like, I thought, like, oh, there was going to be something actually super important in there. What the heck is... Oh, that's a fishing net? Yeah, let's wash our face. Oh! Person, I saved your water bill! I saved money on your water bill. <laughs> Everything's going up in price nowadays, so... You're welcome. Nothing. Not to the basement. Why? Always in the basement. It's so tense. The atmosphere. Like, there's like barely any sound. Like, there's no background music or anything. I just realized. It's just silence. Which is just how it would be. Ooh. Oh, that's, um, you have a pointy nose. Percy, you don't mind me just being in your house, right? I like how I didn't even, like, announce myself. I just kind of busted out. He's going to be behind me, or she. It's going to be behind me. Oh, hello, rat. Oh, that's, like, Tidy Cat's cat litter, huh? I'm scared. This is a dead end. <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh, am I supposed to be running? Running. Walking. I can't run yet? Or I don't have the button to run? Hello? Who's here? Oh, great. Yeah, let me just crawl under this. Hope it doesn't fall on top of me. Wait, what? Didn't you rip your hand on like the side of your hand? Why are you like my hand? The whole part of it. The blood's on your hand from What's the it blood. All this? Wait, it's daytime now? I guess it was almost morning. Anything else new now? No, that's all the same. Okay. Well, thanks for opening up the way for me. Appreciate it, and I'm glad it's morning time now. Oh, I love the snow. Oh, so you don't have to press any button. You just keep straight. That's actually really nice. Especially when you get scared or something and you're just running. Like, you don't have to worry about pressing it. Hurry up pressing all these buttons. As you're freaking out. And these episodes will probably be an hour long. I think I was going to do 30 minutes, but like... Oh, the hell am I? So pretty. Oh, hey. Hey, friend. 
Because I feel like I just won't get a lot accomplished in 30 minutes. Because, I mean, it's already been almost 30 minutes. I guess we jumped down. <sighs> do, do, do. <sighs> I love all the de- oh, I love all the details. Sorry, horsey, that's so sad. The eggs, should I explore more, or? I think this one kind of has more free exploring, right? Wait, should I go? I'm gonna go in here first, then. Cause it seems like this one's playing me. I don't want to like miss a weapon or something, and then I'm just kind of like. Maybe, maybe they're out. You need to pick a lock. Okay, so I need a lock pick. Ew. Oh, that's what I was gonna say during that cutscene where he was like gonna grab the like whatever the soup or whatever it was. He was just gonna grab it with his bare hands because he he didn't try to grab the ladle. He tried to literally grab the whole pot. Oh. Oh, it dragged the horse. Ho 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 Hello? Why did you kill all the horses? Need some kind of other item? Uh, a crank? It already has a rope. Ho ho ho. Nothing in here. Is there a way I can like turn on my flashlight? Because I did the brightness to the game for what it said. I didn't actually mess with it. I just kept in the middle because like I could see everything. What is that sound? The bird? It sound like a pig. That's locked. So we need a lock pick. Chain cutter. It didn't say anything about a key there. A crank. Okay, we got a lot to do. Which is fine. I do like puzzles. Well, these aren't really puzzles. These are just finding one thing to get to the next. I don't know if that's called like a certain type or... Hello? Like, yeah, what did happen here? Something is on there. Oh! What is this doing here? Why is there not talking? Wait, is it supposed to be talking through my controller? Is that what's happening? I think I have that off, but maybe I don't. What on earth is that? This is some demonic stuff here. Oh, look, that looks like kind of a skull. Alright, well, something was on the roof. Oh, this is dead end? Really? Okay. Wait, where am I supposed to be going then? Oh, I can run. I just have to toggle it. So we can go that way. I think this leads back, right? I want to make sure I do check everywhere because I love exploring. Yes, yeah, so that's where we were. Okay, let me check back here really quick. Anything useful? No, just garbage. Okay, just wanted to make sure. I like how even when you walk to like an back to another area, like you just were, there's still the sounds like something is around. Oh, goat heads! Nice. Love to see that on my morning stroll. What happened? I know, right? This has. Okay, graveyard, workshop, and ceremony site. So we were just at the workshop. Graveyard's blocked off. We could probably find a way around. Okay, well, there's still a fire lit there. Anyone home? Or is that like a little secret thing? Like you can shoot that? Locked due to missing homeowner. You can just read this language? To be fair, I don't know what language that is. I don't know if they made that language up or that's in real language. There's a lot of languages in the world, so. Excuse me? Is this a hidey hole? 
No, you can't close the back. Locked. Oh, I think that was a chicken that made that sound. Okay. Whoa. I like how my eyes adjust to the light there. That was cool. Oh, they shut the door. Oh. Some force could break it. Uh, okay, well, I don't have a knife. For oh. <laughs> okay. First aid med kits. I have full of health, don't I? Okay, I got a knife. I'm not afraid to use it. Knives don't break in this game, do they? Did they just run out of the house? Ew, uh, that looks disgusting. Oh, and another thing I was going to mention during the dinner scene, it's funny because I'm... The beginning of RE7, there's the dinner, the iconic dinner scene. So I was like, oh, that's funny. They picked that for the beginning of this too. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I can't just walk through this cloth curtain. Ah, <gasps> no, no. Oh, Friendly. Geez. Friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road and... What's going on? Oh, no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Oh, thank you. Take it! Take it! It might be a horrible shot, it's been a while. Hey, are you listening? Hey! What the? Yeah, how are we not? Oh. Shit! Say, so how about we don't stand under where the dude just got? Was that the dude we just saw? Dead body? And not just one, dead bodies. Wait, there's more. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh. Alrighty. Sir, are you still alive? No. Jesus Christ. What is happening? I can't move. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with this place? Huh. Oh my gosh, I see it right there. Wait, is... I can't move. What's that? What the heck? Was I supposed to do something else there? Oh my god. What the fuck was that? I have a gun, I think. No. Oh. Stop dodging, please. I want a guard. Ooh. Oh, jeez. My bad. Okay. Guarded. Woohoo! You're dead. I don't lose ammo, do I? No, okay. It's fine. What the hell? Yeah, my hand is just bleeding profusely. Okay, and now we're into the thick of it. Fluid. Oh, I probably should heal up. Yeah. Oh, I'm still at green? Materials. Crafting. 
Need an herb and chem fluid for first aid for handgun ammo, two gunpowders, two rusted scraps. Okay. Whee! This is almost my first time playing a newer Resident Evil game. Because, like, I played the demo for... Oh, no, that's a lie, actually. I had to play RE2 Remake on my own. That was before I started my YouTube channel. <laughs> Like there's something in that snow there. All right. I wonder if guys are just gonna spawn like what? A picture of me and Rose. Is that gonna work? Should I shoot this? Oh, I need to find something. I don't know. Can I shoot the lock? Is this where we were? No, this is a different house. I, no, this is where we were, because of shotgun shells. Oh yeah. Maybe I can go behind the curtain this time instead of, wait, I thought I fell to the floor. I'm so confused. What, I think there's gonna be another dude. <gasps> He's gone! He's gone. Snips. I wonder how much force bolt colors like need. What's over here? Nothing. We could play Ring Around the Rosie over here. Oh, I think that's a door. I can't really tell. It's so dark. No. All right, let's just ring around. Hello? Thought I saw a shiny thing, but I also heard something too. Oh, hello there, friend. I. Oh, is that a radio? I know you're nothing. What do you mean? Handgun ammo, nice. <gasps> oh. Gross. Oh, you could be. Oh. Oh. How do I? It won't let me. Okay, so you have to do it where the yellow tape is. Nice, I don't think someone was actually trying to come in. I don't really know. Oh. Of course. No one else here? Oh, wait, weird. <gasps> oh, jeez. Drop down. Just reload really quick. Wait, how do I get out of here? I barricade myself in. Okay, I thought I was gonna jump out. But this is, um, oh, hi. Bye. Well, this is unfortunate. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing here. So I might die. Oh, wait. I was guarding. Oh, I'm dead. What am I supposed to be doing here? Where's this cat? I thought I could jump out the window, you know, like be like Leon. Is it over? Uh oh. There's just the one dude? Could 
have swore there was way more, but okay, I guess it just has to survive that one encounter. I was like freaking out. Wait, now the radio is going off again. What? Watch from the other side? Wait. I have to go back in? Wait, I'm so confused. <laughs> Leave it to me to earn to be... Oh, they broke this down. Okay. Oh. Should I shoot him? Run? Oh my gosh. I didn't see there was like a hundred. Okay, thank you. Is there someone behind me? I'm just rushing. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I think there's someone behind me. I'll grab some scrap if I see it. Oh, hey. Attack flower bats to create cover. Alright. Wait, did I already go this way? Am I going in a circle? Oh jeez. I can't go up, I can't go up, I can't go up, I can't go up. <laughs> Why can I not go up that ladder? Did not want to use my There's knife no on that. I mean my... Shotgun ammo. Oh, I don't know if I'm supposed to go this way. Oh, someone has arrows? Where am I supposed to be going? Okay, I don't know why I ran straight into him. Who's shooting right now? Are they shooting me? Crystal Skull. Oh, you have a big weapon? Got treasure. Oh my! There's so many dudes! I think they're trying to shoot me? Okay. Oh! Woo! Back up. Wait, what happened? What happened? Oh, I barricaded that. I'm so dumb. Do I have a grenade? Grenade would be nice. Grenade would be nice. Is there someone behind me? Well, I kind of trapped myself, so I need to die. Uh. Oh. Wait. How do I? I'm being so horrible. Wait, I don't want it. Wait, did I not use that? Oh. Wait, how do I use my knife? Oh, hi, goodbye. Go, 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 go. I don't know how to use my knife. I'm just stuck. Oh, hi. Was I actually supposed to kill all these dudes? Oh, this is a 
dead end. What is this? It's locked. Maybe I can. I was gonna say, maybe I can craft some ammo. Wow, this went horribly. I died. Okay, bye! What on earth? Hello. Smashing my skull. This is a long death scene. Is this not supposed to happen? Or is this supposed to happen? They left me behind? That was so chaotic. I did so bad. I didn't know what I was supposed to do. I blocked that one door from the outs inside, so I couldn't go back through that way. I I didn't know if I could use my knife. Maybe I don't... Why does I have my... Oh my gosh, I'm dumb. It really says to equip, but you have to use left analog, like the D-pad. That makes sense. It's just like trying to figure things out while also trying to survive. Okay, well, I apparently I survived that. I wonder if it was on a timer, or if I was supposed to almost die? Okay, well, I have no ammo. Wait, I'm almost dead. Or maybe I was supposed to get shot by the arrow for that all to occur? There we go. Oh, that would have been... Yeah, sorry, that was so chaotic. And I was even trying to craft the ammo. Okay. Now we got ammo. We have a first aid kit. I have full health right now, somehow. I guess because that end. Okay, so let's reload this. And now, oh wow, that was pretty bad. Don't judge me, <laughs> or judge me. Um, it's just, it was it's been so long since I played a game like this. And then it was like, it, they just throw me in. It was like, all right now, figure it out. And I'm just like, what? Okay, cause yeah, I know there's stuff I definitely missed. I wonder if stuff despawns like the items that they drop. Cause now we have time to explore. I don't know how I go back in that room though. I forget where I came out of it. Cause there's definitely stuff in there. I think I came out of it through this side. Wow, my heart is like racing. That was such a doozy. Where did I come out of? And I know there was another explo- oh, here. Yeah, there's the flower, but I don't really know what that would have done me. I know it said it's for distraction, or like, basically smoke bomb, essentially. But like, I was down here, they weren't coming down here a after me. I wouldn't be surprised if there is still someone here. Okay. So yeah, this is where I was. I left a lot behind. Oh, the shotgun! Glad I did come back. Nice. Er. Okay, I'm not gonna have this. Well, I guess I can, because I know the way in now. And also, I think we're leaving this area anyways. I'm going to still equip my knife for now. Okay, so that goes back. So I think we might have fully explored everywhere now. I'm still going to check because there are some people I killed. I don't, like I said, I don't know if their uh, items despawn after a certain time. Because I know in normal RE4 they do. So they might have. Also, I don't really know where that was. I just ran over everywhere. <coughs> So, there's a barrel here. What is that? Could have shot that if they came in here. 
Oh, and it was this side of the ladder. Okay. What is up here? Oh, this would have been the roof to jump off. Oh, this would have been so helpful. I will say, I never claim to be the best at games. In fact, I'm pretty sure it's even in my YouTube, uh, like my description to my channel. What was... Oh, that's just to move the thing. Alright, so I think we are good here. That's a dead end. Is that sound of Jingle Bells kind of like a secret? Where is where I killed so many dudes? Because I got the crystal skull. I mean, I guess they're gone. I don't even remember everywhere I went. So that's back to the beginning area. Oh, and that's the ring around Rose. Wait, this is open now? Oh, we did go down here. And that's locked. Okay. See, so yeah, I'm gonna go to the new section. Which is... Wait, is that through here? No, this is back... Wait, where did she go? Oh, no. Oh, she went over here, yeah. Alright, and this stuff I haven't been to at all. Oh, this must have been where I blew them up. Okay. Locked? There's a weird symbol on the door. Can I... I had to double check. Oh, it's you making that sound. Hi. In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? Uh, it's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? The castle bell heralds danger. They're coming. <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. They're coming again. Yeah, I'm glad I explored as you're about to lock me in. Also, they're coming. Does that mean the enemies are coming right now? Oh, I think I hear one. Alright. Is this a church? Maybe. It looks like it might be. Oh, all right, we just worship a demon. That's okay. Oh, great lichens, the fabled monster wolves of old. May they come to eat our flesh, may they come to tear us apart. Why? So they are werewolves, okay. Can we hide under the bed? No. Also, I feel like this isn't really a sneaky game. Oh, yeah. So we must be able to come back here with a lockpick or something? Oh, I wonder if this is that lady's house. So far, she's the only one alive. That's not a werewolf. Unless everyone in this town's a werewolf. Well, no, we saw dead bodies. But how are there so many more werewolves compared to, I feel like, people that have lived in this town? View map. Oh, that's really nice. So... Blue, everything's out of it. Lockpick? Does that mean... Okay, that means you need a lockpick it. Iron insignia key, that's for the gate that had a lock. I might have been able to shoot that lock. Okay, that's really nice. I like how they do that so you know what you're missing or not. This looks like a big arena. Wait, where does this go? Ceremony site... Castle, Domestic, I don't know how to say their name. I've always said it wrong, Domestic, Domestic. Lock from the other side. Okay, so we can't go that way yet. Do, do, do. Now that I know how to switch weapons, <laughs> I should be better, I feel like I at combat. Well, I don't know how effective the knife is. The other side of the cart. 
Might be able to crawl under there. Nope. I move fast. Oh, another one. So we need another crank. Does this lead somewhere? No. Okay, a lot of these things are blocked off, which I guess is good. Oh, thank you. Rest of scrap just sitting on the seat. We could probably craft a lot of things now. I have a lot of resources too. Wait, so there is treasure in the... Wait. I haven't really been looking out for that. That shiny is not as, like, shiny. <laughs> Which makes sense. It wouldn't be, like, super glimmering. Okay, so now i got to look out for a shinies, too. Because I don't think it would tell you, like, if you missed that. What is this? Hello. We offer these goats of warding to protect the village and its people. Any who break them shall fill Mother Miranda's wrath. Wrath. So... If I break it, they're going to come for me? Okay, let's wait a little bit for that then. Huh. How do I get in there? Because it didn't look like it had a lock or anything on it. Sorry. I need the herb. Okay, wait. Let me just... Let's see. It might start a fight. It might not. No? Okay, good. I think I'm going to sneeze. <coughs> oh, sorry. Oh, one of these. Guess this leads to the castle. Yeah, we need two things for that. There's a gate here. I do like having the full village to explore. I mean, this is literally called Resident Evil Village. Should we explore the outside first? Oh, wait. Wait, what? There's so many ways. There's so many ways. Oh, what is that? Just the light? Oh, this is the church. Oh. Let me guess, if I pick that up, stuff's gonna come. What is that? Oh, yeah. I remember. Yeah. Oh, should disaster fall upon the village, seek out the crest. One is in the care of the church, the other is at Louisa's house. So we just got the church one. Okay, so Louisa's is... Yeah, I saw those stairs, but down... That's a big house. Okay. Why can I not pick that up? Oh, we don't need a um, ink ribbon. That's really nice. All right, so I think I could just end the up. Well, let's see. Is there about be something outside? Hello. No one cares that I picked that up. Yeah, I think we're gonna just end the first episode here. Once again, I apologize for my horrible fighting scene, my freaking out. But it should be better now that I know the control. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited to continue our journey, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.